Hi guys, this is Brian Bennett, Laptop Magazine. Here we have the new Mango uh, release for Windows Phone, and we're basically going to get a little demo of the group feature. All right, so, so how does that work? All right, so here I have um, what looks like two contacts pinned to my start screen. I've got Andy Lee's, just an individual contact, but I've also got a group here of friends that I've pinned up here. You see it's rotating through pictures of each person. I can tap on that, and I can see all the people that are in the group. I can pivot across here and see what's new, filtered by the group. I can get information. I can check out pictures that, that the people on the group have actually posted or that have been they've been tagged in. And I also have the ability to come down here and say I can send email to the group as one as a as a like a distribution list, or I can I can communicate with them so I can see that three or four, three or four of these uh, people have the ability to receive text messages, have mobile numbers, and two or four of them are online. So one quick touch, and I can communicate with the two that are online very quick. So how are these groups actually grouped? I mean, do you group them yourself manually or? Yeah, I create them myself right here in the People Hub. So I can hit the little plus button, create a brand new group. I can come in here to say a current group that's going, hit edit, and I can sit here and I can add new people to it, just very simply. Now I've added another person to that group. Okay, and then basically uh, all this information is like sort of pictures and all that stuff. Is that coming from Facebook or? It's it's reaching out to Facebook, it's reaching out to Live, okay. and all the services that we're touching, and Facebook Live, Twitter, okay. so on. So it's able to reach out, grab that information, and aggregate it down. Is it able to aggregate groups automatically if you want to? What do you mean by automatically? Like, say, like, you know, recent people you talk to, or things like that? Um, not, not in that way. Okay. It's not in that way, but part of the new thing that we've got with, say, cards allows me to go through and go into, you know, I don't really have anything for Andy, but but I've got what's new for Andy, pictures of Andy. I don't have any history right now with Andy, but but it would show right. me, you know, emails, but, uh, missed calls, everything there. But, but if he was sharing me. a lot of his life with you, you'd be able to, you know, I'd be able to look into it and spy on him if I wanted to. Very cool. All right, thanks a lot. Appreciate that.